Hey guys, this is Lydia, trying to conceive vlog. This is video, I believe it's either video 15 or video 16. I'm on cycle day three and um, I'm going to, I have a few things to go over with you guys today. So first thing is I want to show you when I, I went back to Borders and I got the books that I told you guys I was going to get. The first book was um, The Hypnobirthing and that cost me $19.95 um, and that one's, if some of you guys don't know, comes with like a CD in the back. I don't think you guys can see it that great. It comes with a CD back here and also I got the other book. Um, let's let the light focus. Um, Taking Charge of Your Fertility. This is a great book. This is $24.95. I had this book before. I got it off of Amazon for a little bit cheaper. But um, during my move, um, packing up and moving to Texas and then moving back, it got misplaced. But I love this book, not only for all of the information that it does have, but I hope you guys can see this. Up here, it gives you like examples of charting. I don't think you guys can see it that great. It gives you examples of charting. Um, cervical mucus, CM. These three pictures. And these three pictures down here is your um, cervical positioning. So it gives you that. It gives you like a little wheel that you can look at. Some other um, charts. More or less how to read charts, how to take temperatures, how to check your cervical mucus, your cervical positioning, um, stuff like that. It is an easy read book. I had it before and I read most of it um, just to get the gist of it and I loved this book. So it's a great investment. Um, unfortunately today I did not have the chance to go and get the supplements that I told you guys I was going to get. Reason being... Um, I went and um, spent some time with one of my friends. I haven't seen her, I want to say, since Jan July of last year, before I moved to Texas. Since I moved back, um, she had a baby. I was in Mexico, um, you know, stuff like that. So we had too much going on in our lives, but today we finally had extra time and we made time to go and get our nails done and see. I got my nails done. So first time in like almost a year, you guys. And um, when I got my eyebrows professionally done, I love how they came out. So, you know, I just figured I'd doll myself up because my husband and I will start baby dancing pretty soon. And I'm going to try to make it as romantic as possible and not make it seem like it's time that we have to do it. Um, so I just wanted to, you know, change this change things up a little and it's been a while since I've gotten my nails done so I figured I'd go and get my nails done today um other than that um I got the books so it's hopefully tomorrow if my husband has time before he goes to work I will go and get those supplements and then I'll make a, a mini video or just upload pictures of how they look in the doses and stuff dosage and stuff like that um, I know you guys are probably sick of here seeing me by now because this is already the third video this week, I believe, um, that I've already done. Yeah, I think I did one Sunday and Monday. Yesterday I didn't do the one, so today I did one. Oh, and I started Clomid yesterday. Um, two pills. I did my two pills of Clomid, two pills of iron, and one pill of folic acid. Did the same thing today. So I'm keeping up with that. Um, all the way into through Saturday, I have to take the Clomid. And then after that, it's just the two iron pills and the two folic acid. And then as soon as I get those other pills, I'm going to start taking those as needed. Or as um, the herbalist tells me, I need to take them. I think that was all that I needed to tell you guys today. I don't know why I thought there was so many other things to talk to you guys about oh you know what really quick i'm gonna put the link up um on the side so you guys can see but i went to wiseways.com and i found 
fertility oil. It's called Mary Mother Fertility Oil. It comes in a four ounce for $9.90. Um, and it says right here, I'm just going to give you a brief description of what it says. It says a unique nourishing blend of herbs and oils to enhance fertility and conception to harmonize and strengthen the female system, especially during menses and pregnancy. So this is for external use and only, and you massage into the lower abdomen and uterine, ur, uterine area. You know, I was reading on what it contains, like, for instance, I'm only going to name off a few. Um, there's so many that it has, but spearmint um, is one, red raspberry, plantain, alfalfa, lemon balm, um, vitex, which is chest, berry, chest tree berries, wild yam, black hawk. I mean, the list goes on and on of what it contains. So I'm going to put the link up to the side. If you guys have ever heard of that type of stuff or like so much as a, a fertility oil, please give me your reviews on it. Um, I would greatly appreciate it and um, I think that's it I wanted to go over with you guys today but before I call I want to say thank you to every single one of you guys that responded to my last video I really appreciate it I did appreciate the feedback thank you Meg for the um, for the um, review on this book I went I had to get it so I went and got it and um, thank you, Lizzie, for doing the video response. Greatly appreciated all of your guys' information. All of you guys that sent me comments and all that stuff and reviews. It is going to help me 100% of the way. Um, I have started temping. Yesterday's temp was 97.18. Today's temp was 96.98 or something like that. So... I would show you guys my charts, but I'm just going to put a link to the side because I don't know how to add to the end of this video when I'm doing uh, recording directly from my webcam. So be on the lookout for that. And I think that's it. So I will try to update you guys tomorrow just to show you the, the um, what do you call it, the um, pills that I bought. If not, most definitely I will be updating on Friday. So, I will talk to you guys later. Oh, and um, any comments, concerns, questions, suggestions, reviews, anything like that, anything that I talk about, please let me know. Um, you guys already know, um, you know, comments, personal messages, emails, anything like that. Just let me know, video responses. I do apologize if I don't get back to you on um, right away. It's just that... Once I sit down and start watching videos or start uploading videos, I only have that specific amount of time, and then I have to get dinner ready. But then afterwards, if I go back and I read it, I make a mental note to myself that I have to go back the next day and comment back because, you know, the little bit of time that I see my husband when he's home, we want to, you know, relax together and stuff like that. So I do apologize if it's taken me a lot longer to respond to you guys. Uh, I know you guys are responding, and thank you so much, and I will be responding back to you guys very soon. So, thank you so much, baby dust to all of you guys out there, and sticky vibes to all of you guys as well. You guys have a good one, okay? Bye.